Esther. 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 wanted to surprise him. How could he know? Sleeping with another woman. Ah! Philip, you told me you love me. You promised. You said you love me. How could you do this to me? How? I don't even know this guy. I don't know him. Help me. How long has this been happening? Sir? How long has it been deceiving my daughter? Sir, please. I don't. It's, it's not what you think, sir. It's not what it looks like. I, I, I didn't mean for this to happen. I just. I don't even know how we got to this. Off. I will not bring myself so low to marry such a cheap man, such a disgrace to men and church. I am done! Hey, my daughter, wait, 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 don't go, don't go, wait, wait! How can that be? Why? How can she call off the wedding? No. No, 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 it will not happen. Don't you? You can't call off the wedding. No, Philip. Philip, I spent on the parents! Explain to them what has happened! Tell them how sickened that guy is and that you have nothing to do with Sickened? Did you say sickened? The truth is I don't know who's more sickened between you and me. pleased with this thing. Do you really love Esther that much? Yes! Esther is the perfect one. She's everything any man would ever need in a wife. She's homely. She's calm. She's humble. Beautiful. And to top it all, she's the best cook that I have ever seen. Okay. So all those things are really nice, but Let's, let's hold up on the wife thing. Uh, we're not there yet. And what's holding us? Philip, you are a respected man in the church. Your pastor can vouch for you. As for Esther, she's done with school. So what's going to hold us? I think it's too early. People will think that there's an ulterior motive. Of course there is. Yes. And that is to make her your wife. And then get access to the family wealth. Philip, are you changing your mind? Philip, are you changing your mind? Swallowed my pride Whatever it takes Whatever To cross the takes. bridge How we do it Oh my love Cause when you're not here When you're not here I feel so empty Cause when you're not here By my side I feel so lonely Oh I love you Never Have you 
you've lost your senses. Philip has killed so many born mad. Are you crazy? What are you going to do with that thing? That worship thing that the parents feel from hand to mouth. How dare you? Philip! What are you going to do with wretchedness? What are you going to do with poverty? Are you okay? I love Zaba. What did you just say? I love Zaba. Shut your dirty mouth up! Shut it up! Shut it up! Close it! What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? How dare you? How dare you? Philip, I hate poverty! I hate it! I hate this poverty! How dare you? Now listen. And listen very good. If anything happens to our plan, Philip, if anything happens to our plan, I'll kill myself. Just leave Chizoba out of this. Because it is you that I blame. It is you that I blame. Your quest for wealth you did not labor for. That's what got us into this mess. Excuse me. Philip! 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 Uh, uh, Let me get that from her. Get down! Get down! Get down from her! What is this for wealth? Wait, wait. What? What do you mean you don't want to come back? Honey, did you hear that? Mommy, please, I don't know how to do this. There are so many memories in the city that haunts me. Sweetheart, but you haven't lived a on your own before. I will learn. Mom, I'm living alone now, so it's... It is different. That was just service. Please, Mom. Please don't make this harder than it is already. I'm trying to pick up the pieces of my life. I'm trying to fix me. Please, honey. Come on. Please. Um, Esther. When are you leaving? And what exactly do you want us to do for you? Just anything. Name it. To make life easy for you, wherever you go. I'll let you know when I'm ready. Good. Thank you, Dad. All right, it's your girl, okay? No, 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 no. I can hide it anymore. I really need to let you know. I've swallowed my pride Whatever it takes Whatever To cross the bridge How we do it Oh my love Cause when you're not here When you're not here I'm oh, so baby, you have a heart! I missed you so much I miss you too, daddy oh, my <laughs> Hello, how are you? This is Justin. Justin, my friends. Sir, ma'am, it's a pleasure to finally get to meet the two of you. You have no idea how much I have looked forward to this day. He's really handsome. You've made a good choice. Thank you. Uh, Oh, oh, let's miss. Shall we? Shall we all go inside? Yeah, yes. Absolutely. Let's go.
Ah, oh, you're very much welcome. Hope Thank the journey you. wasn't so stressful. Um, no, it was, it was good. All right. Here is your room. Hope you enjoy your vacation with us. Ah, uh, I will. All right. Oh, thank you. I'll see you later. Bye. Shall we? Young man, what do you do for a living? I work in a company. So, what is your designation in that company? I mean, what exactly do you do for the company? Investment strategy planning. That's my department at Uchi Nancy Group of Companies. Mm. Um, yes, Dad. You see, um, Justin's family runs an investment company. Wow. Yes. But well, that's not the only thing that I do. I, uh, I have no intentions of staying in the family business for that long, so I'm already branching out into food business. Uh, I own a few bar and restaurants that I bought after they made a little comeback. Uh, if I heard you correctly, you say you run a bar? Yes. So, what exactly do you sell in the bar? Drinks. All kinds of drinks. You mean you run a mini club where boys and girls come together half naked? Uh, oh, the honey, I'm sure they must have been furnished from the long travel. Let's go and eat first. We can continue the conversation later. But told you, we, we, we're trying to get acquainted. Are, are we not all famished? Yes, well, we are. Actually. Yeah, so let's, 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 let's go, go to the dining. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.
a lot. <laughs> Thank okay. you. Careful. There you go. You don't want this one? No, it's right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sam, can you tell us more about your family? Mom, I... You are not Justin, my dear. Let him speak for himself. It's okay, babe. I got this. We are two boys. Um, I'm the second son. My older brother got married. He got married about a year ago. And my mother, she runs a supermarket. Actually, that's where the family business started before my dad started investing into dilapidated businesses and reviving them back to life. Wow. That's interesting. Your mom must be a virtuous woman to have carried the family along even in difficult times. Oh, she is. <laughs> She's actually one of the strongest women that I know. Really? And who is the other one? Esther. You guys might not know this, but she shares a lot of similarities with my mother. That's why she has me so good. Um, of course, uh, Esther is a very strong girl. Because that is the way we brought her up. We brought her up to be very strong. But what baffles me is, uh, you have painted a picture of uh, her having qualities that are synonymous with that of your mother's. Yet, um, both of you cannot see eyeball to eyeball, so I wonder. Yeah. That was a long time ago, Dad. That's all in the past now. <clears throat> um, you will agree with me that the past fashions the present and the future, right? It actually did. We were just in night together. And I couldn't have been any happier. Um, Esther, you need a man that is called fearing. You need a man that can lead you to the heart of God. I mean, happiness can only be obtained from God. Eternal happiness. I don't see him as someone who can do that. Because he, he possesses qualities that are very, very far away from what mm. the Bible says. Uh, young man, no offense uh, meant. Okay. No offense? You need every offense that. Let's start. Have I said anything that is wrong? Hey. Hey. Still busy? Hmm? Okay, so I'm, I'm going out with my mom. Out? Yes, out with my mom. She's going to see her designer, so I just want to go with her. Oh, okay. Um, babe? I'm really sorry, okay? I mean, I know we came here to see your parent, and I seem to be, you know, spending the whole time working. Baby, you don't have to apologize, okay? It's nothing. I totally understand. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Okay. Okay, so do you want anything? Ice cream, pizza, cookies? Um, actually, I have something more specific in mind. <laughs> Go on. You. Just bring back you. That's all I want. Yeah. 
You didn't, sir. I didn't realize your body. Oh, boy. I was wondering, sir. Is there some other reason you don't like me? Apart from the fact that I'm not, you know, a Christian Christian. And what do you mean by Christian Christian? I'm not dumb, sir. I think I can tell when someone likes me for something and when it's otherwise. I don't hate you. But you don't like me either. Let me ask you this. What did you use to entice my daughter? Sir, with all due respect, I genuinely liked your daughter the first time I saw her when I moved into that compound. Okay, I felt something for her. But somehow, somewhere, things didn't work because of our different opinions. Exactly the point. But, sir, I... I hate the butt! Look, my daughter is a Christian. She's well brought up as a Christian, but you are not. I'm not even sure you've opened your Bible for a very long time now. The difference between you and my daughter is that my daughter is well brought up, but you were badly brought up. Look at me. I don't like you. I don't want to pretend. You cannot marry my daughter. Go out there and look for the kind of girls that will suit your kind of person. Leave my daughter alone. I can hide it anymore. Yeah. I really need to let you know how I feel. I've swallowed my pride. Whatever it takes Whatever to cross the bridge, how we do it. Oh, my love. Hey, Daddy. Hey, you're back. What took you so long? Mm, honey. Oh. Ah. Esther and I needed to try out that merchandise she had. And thank God you're able to connect it to my face. It's alright, you're welcome. Thank you. So how have you been? Well, I'm good. Just watch your temperature. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll just tell uh, Jumoke to hurry up with dinner so that I can have something. That's alright. <laughs> Excuse me.
the truth. I told him the truth. He's not good for you. I tried to tell you, but you were blinded with love. Fortunately for me, he accepted. Oh, oh honey, please. Uh, Esther, please, can we calm down and... Don't tell me to calm down, Mom! Don't! Tell me what did Justin ever do to you? He's a womanizer. A chronic one at that. I mean, there are other men out there with high nobility and dignity. Why he? He is the embodiment of nobility and dignity. But you so blatantly refused to open up to him, so how could you even see those qualities? Daddy, how did you know about his past? So you knew? Of course I knew. Don't tell me you took up his past. I had to. He's planning to marry my daughter and it is my responsibility to carry out due diligence. Yes. Great. Kudos, Dad. Congratulations! Thank you. Esther. Justin, when he asked him to leave. I never asked him to leave. He left out of his own volition. What difference does it make, Dad? I leave this house for what? For two seconds? And all you could do was ask my boyfriend to leave? What kind of a father does that? A father who cares for his daughter. I brought you up as a good Christian. That man is not a Christian. He does not have the fear of God. He, he, he believes in God, all right. Just not in the excessive eye service that most Christians do, which is exactly what you are doing, Father. Excuse me? Oh, you heard me loud and clear. You preach the Bible and the likeness of Christ. Yet, you cannot obey his word. Didn't the Bible ask us not to hate the sinner but the sin? Didn't that same Bible ask us not to judge? But well, what are you doing, Dad? You, 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 you dug up some, some debts about him and, and capitalizing on his own ideology of not being a Christian, you cast him away. All he ever wanted was for you to see him as a son. My son, you say? I can't even have that kind of a man as my son in law. Talk about being my son. Have you suddenly forgotten what your so-called Christian brother did to me? That was in the past. We are now in the present. Let that one remain buried. What is it? Four years! Four freaking years! That was what it took me to be happy again. And I found that happiness because of justice. Battered and heartbroken. All I do every day is just live life like I'm a passenger on earth. I wasn't living the life. And to make matters worse, Justin was never helpful because of the kind of life he lived. Oh. 
Say it once again. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, give me a second, go right back. Second for Papi. Hello. Thank you. Sorry, didn't even realize I was walking here. Babe, get in the car. Sure. <laughs> What? Work for daddy. Do that work. Stretch for daddy. Strong. There you go. <laughs> Trust me bro, I love my life like this. So simple, without any girl complications. I'm happy. <laughs> You're the one I should be worried about. <laughs> now you didn't marry, not me. How? <laughs> You're happy being a lonely man. Lonely? Do I look lonely to you? You are lonely. Yeah, I'm bawling. How can you how can you be happy? Just you alone in this world. It's not possible now. Oh my god. Here comes my favorite girl. <laughs> Your favorite girl. Just watch and see. Mm. I just want you to look at the legs, the way she walks. Just watch. Oh, mm. oh my God. Hi. Esther, how are you? Oh, good evening. Evening. Good evening. How are you two? I'm doing good. I take it that service went well. Uh, tremendous, actually. <laughs> oh. It's really been a minute. Yeah, as you can see, I've been busy with lots of things. That's why. I understand. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Good evening. Hi. Is it she? That's your friend. Yes. Yeah. I, I, yes. I, she is. Yeah. She is my friend. She. You know what? I. I'll just let you guys continue with your thing while we head in. We're actually tired. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. So okay, let's go. Good okay. To see you. Yeah, sure. <laughs> yes, let's go. Okay. Oh. Austin, such a nice girl. <laughs> Tell you. Oga, okay. let me remind you. Hmm? Remember, you have a girlfriend. Oh, what am I saying? <laughs> girlfriend, you have a fiance that you're getting married to in less than two months. So I don't understand that, oh, nice girl that you're doing with that girl. I, I don't get it. No, no, you're trying to tell me that I shouldn't talk to my friend. Is that what you're saying? And since when did you two become friends? Justin, that you hate this girl doesn't mean I should. She's a nice girl. Okay, I'll tell you what she is. She's annoying. Oh, <laughs> that makes it even perfect for you two. Yes! Imagine you guys falling for each other. Oh, should it be a blissful disaster? <laughs> Lol, keep dreaming. Very funny. Nice girl, nice girl. My brother, why are you looking for him? Is he in or not? Oh, you want me to answer your question, but you don't consider mine worthy of an answer, huh? Oh, Esther. Jeremy. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> I just wanted to check if you're still around. Oh. Yeah, I, I brought this for you. Wow. A little something for Sunday. I wasn't sure if you've had something to eat. 
You don't actually think I'll starve my own brother, do you? As you can see, we're just about to eat. Jeremy, Justin, I don't think I can continue with this noodles yet. Uh, Esther, this is what he always fits me with any time I come here. Okay. So, yeah. Are you serious? <laughs> Esther, thank you so much. You're welcome. I really appreciate it. Uh, you're welcome. Uh, have a nice day, okay? Yeah, are you are you are you for real? What was that now? I don't you think you should be careful? I mean, come on now. With your wedding date fast approaching, you should be careful. Wife who you eat from. How? Do you think she put love potion in the food or what? I wouldn't be surprised if she did. She looks like it. I mean, she has made it a norm to always give you food whenever you are around. And she has never extended the same courtesy to me. Don't you think it's fishy? Mm -mm. The only thing I find fishy here is your jealousy. Come on, Esther is not that kind of girl. And I must say she's just being herself and to couple it up. She's a fine girl. <laughs> and you know this because you live with her? Justin, Justin you, 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 you complain a lot. Connect this in no job. <laughs> no job, you and who? You want chop cook no me. You want me to get chop cook no me with you. Oh Allah, just the chop. By the time you leave your fiance, begin they call Esther. Esther day and night. Now you go no see which night the talk makes sense. Chop. The chop cook no me. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 
There we go. Oh. Oh. Okay, swallow. Sorry. Okay. Oh. Okay. Um. Do you have an ice pack? I should have something in my apartment. Be right back. No, you, you don't have to. Okay, you. <sighs> All right. It's local but effective. This will help. Feel any better? Kinda, it's it feels a lot better. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, sure. Thank you so much. Well, I know we don't see eye to eye on a lot of things, but the last thing I would do was to leave you the helpless. I wouldn't even do it to my enemy. I'm serious. You're the one that has issues with me for reasons best known to you. Really? Okay. I have to go now. I have a breakfast appointment and I can't afford to be late. You might need this later. leave the house yes sir she drive her car come out for the compound obviously i can see that i mean did someone come to see her maybe the person drove her car out no okay justin i think the driver her car come out by herself open the gate what she drove out I mean, how can she put herself through such strenuous activity after everything she's been through? Some people, eh, they, they just need to use their heads. Are you okay? I mean, are you trying to kill yourself? How could you leave the house and you even drove? Why? After everything you've been through this morning. Calm down, okay? I didn't go far. I just needed to do something. 
Besides, it's just a muzzle cramp. It's nothing too serious. And you're still clearly in pains. It will suffice with time. I just need to go in and rest, that's it. Yeah, you need a lot of rest, okay? Soak your feet in warm water and it will help with the pain. Massage your calves too. I can hide it anymore. I really need to let you know how I feel. I've swallowed my pride. Whatever it takes to cross the bridge. How we do it. Yes. How can I help you? Is 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 just an inn? And who are you? Oh, let me guess. The nest hall is about to sleep with. Excuse you? What did you just call me? What did you just hear? <laughs> Listen, darling. Let me educate you on something. I know about you all bitches. Yeah, from number one to number hundred. And you know what? It doesn't faze me at all. You want to know why? Because no matter where he goes, he always come back to me. Yeah, you want to know why? Because he can't seem to get enough of the sexy olive skin of mine. Mm -hmm. Okay, I... I'm really going to pretend I didn't hear any of what you just said because... You because don't... what? Yeah, because what? Because everything you just heard are true. No, they're not, Lakisha. They're not. She has more sense and dignity than you do. What are you still doing in my house? I thought I asked you to leave. Esther, I am so sorry. Save it. I am not interested in anything you have to see. Okay? Here. A token of my appreciation for helping me out the other time. And please, next time make sure you put this dog of yours on your leash. Babe! Babe, I mean, I mean, are you, you insane? Insulting my neighbor like that? What were you thinking? Were you even thinking at all? You're right. I wasn't. I mean, how could I be when, when upon my arrival, all the stories I hear around town is about you parading ladies all around town? Did you even for a second stop to think how I would feel? Do I look like I care about your dumb, stupid feelings? I see if you care about mine, not that I, I have any feelings for you. Really? Look, I am done, okay? I am done playing this whole platonic thing with you. Clearly, you don't understand what the word platonic means, do you? I am not dumb like you, Justin. I am not. And if you want to break up with me, man up and say so. Why do I need to break up with you when we haven't even been in a relationship to start with? Justin! You wanted the truth, and I'm giving it to you. Look, this whole thing we had between us was just sex, nothing else, okay? None of us wanted this whole commitment thing. And did you see me forming a jealous boyfriend when I heard about your escapades with your numerous boyfriend in and out of the country? Please, just go inside, pack your things, and leave. You know what, Justin? You are one son of a bitch! You're just a bastard. I am... Um, I'm returning this and I was hoping to talk to you. As you can see, I'm going out. Within the neighborhood, I guess? Yeah. I want to get some stuff from the convenience store down the road. Okay, fine. Can I walk you? Then maybe we can talk. Talk? I'm listening. Oh boy. Um, how do I put this? I want you to be my date to my brother's wedding. 
You're really... Okay, first of all, I need to apologize for how Lakisha spoke to you. It was out of place. I know you really don't care, but she and I were never together. She visited you more than the other girls you were with, yet you're not together. That's really laughable. For someone who doesn't really care about my life, you seem to... to... I will not be your date. Yes, I'll be attending your brother's wedding, but not as your date. Never. Oh, look. I know we started off on the wrong foot, and my lifestyle is not something you're very comfortable with, but I'm not going to apologize for that. That's me. And that's why I really need you to be my date. Wow. You want me to ward them off? No, no, please. I just want you to be my date. I can hide it anymore. Yeah. I really need to let you know how I feel. I've swallowed my pride. Whatever it takes to cross the bridge, I'll do it. Again. <laughs> I, I just I just remembered that bad joke you played on your brother. <laughs> you you're so mean. I swear. <laughs> no, 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 truly, 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 you just need to count yourself lucky that his wife didn't murder you. <laughs> no, <right. laughs> I swear. In everything you had it in you. <laughs> well, I have a lot more in me. It's sad we don't see eye to eye. And whose fault is that? Come, let me walk you to your door. Please don't laugh again. No more laughing tonight. Cause it feels like you can't get that joke out of your head. Out of your head. I swear. Okay, it's enough. Okay, okay, let me. I'll try. I promise. I'll try. I'll try. It's not making me laugh now. Okay, okay. Straight face. Straight face. <laughs> surprised. Why would I be? I mean, a full-fledged young lady like you went on a two-day wedding trip with Mr. Sinfully Handsome and nothing happened. Are you even listening to me at all? Okay. What about the part where I told you how nice his parents are? Or oh, even the parts where I told you about the comics that happened over there. You didn't hear that one? I did, but those ones are not even important. Yes, Esther, I am in for a serious business. So start you, talking. You, you, want, wait, you, you want to know if I slept with him? Are you serious? Really? Well, 
I see you're beginning to allow new changes flip to your side. Uh, he's my neighbor, Ogi. And just because we happen to have moved past our differences or can make few sentences without crossing each other, doesn't mean I'm into him. Ah, okay, you make a hear lies. Lies, lies, lies. Esther, you know that you're lying and you also know that I do not believe you one bit. You and this guy obviously have something going on. And you have just refused to tell me what it is. But I'll find out. There's nothing to tell if you don't even believe me. So, I want your business. Hmm. So, are you guys ready? Ready to go? Ready for what? Church, aren't you going for your usual Tuesday evening program? Y yeah, we are. <sighs> are, you, are, you, are, you, are you going to church? Of yes, of course. <laughs> I'm not exactly a sinner. I just, I just haven't been to church in the longest time. But it doesn't make me a sinner, right? What? Of course, of course, of course, you are welcome to church. You know, the house of the Lord can accommodate one more person. So why not? You're welcome to join us, church. And so does her car. Energy. See, this is the kind of energy that the Lord appreciates. Okay? Esther, you obviously still have one or two things to learn about Christianity. Okay? Good. I'm ready when you ladies are. Of course, we're ready. We're ready to go to church. Church. That was how it all started. We started talking, sharing, and even understanding each other. He took me to the movies, the park, even occasionally to his parents' house for family gatherings, something he wouldn't do with any girl. He was different with me, without even knowing I had been counting how many dates we've been on. And finally, he asked me out officially for the first time. Yeah. Thank you for today. Sure thing. Um, <clears throat> I, um, I've been meaning to ask you for something. Okay. Would you mind going out with me on a proper date? A date? Mm. Oh, why? Well, because I don't know what to call all of these things going on between us. But whatever the case is, I would like to take you out on a proper date. If you don't mind. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Swallowed my pride Whatever it takes Whatever To cross the takes. bridge How we do it Oh my love Cause when you're not here When you're not here I feel so empty Cause when you're not here By my side I feel so lonely oh, I love you Never Wow. Excuse me. Notima. You look lovely. Thank you. Hey, don't I know you? Yes, ma. We met at um, Mr. Jorah Smith's wedding. Exactly. Yes. Oh, wow. How are you? I'm very fine, ma. Uh, that's good. What are you doing here? 
Oh yeah, I will be your chauffeur for this evening. Mr. Justin is expecting you. Shall we? I can hide it anymore yeah. I really need to let you know How I feel I've swallowed my pride Whatever it takes Whatever To cross the bridge How we do it Oh my love Cause when you're not here When you're not here I feel so empty Cause when you I'm sure you have a lot of questions. Ask away. Questions? I don't actually. Hmm. Have I told you that you are the most beautiful woman I've ever set my eyes on? <laughs> Is that a blush? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I've ordered for food. I want you to try something different. So, I hope you like it. I hope so too. <laughs> but are you impressed, generally? Uh, let's see how this goes first. Mm. I'll wait till you Wow. You seem like a very difficult woman to please. Am I? Am I? <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Nice. Yeah? Yeah. Thank you. I aim to please. <laughs> She's crazy, I tell you. Yeah. It crazies of us three. <laughs> <laughs> what if she's not wrong? I mean, what if I'm attracted to you, not just sexually, but in every way possible? Are you asking me or you're telling me? All of the above. It's nothing to be nervous about, okay? I mean, you must have felt the same way at some point, too, so... I'm not asking for an answer right now, but I'm going to need an answer eventually after I have done things the right way. I can hide it anymore. Yeah. I really need to let you know how I feel. I've swallowed my pride. Whatever it takes Whatever to cross the takes. bridge, how we do it. My love, cause when you're not here, when you're not here, I feel so empty. And just like that, we had our second, third, and even fourth dates. And I tell you, for each of them, he outdoors himself. Just me alone, all by myself But I can't I've been so addicted to you That I can stay without Seeing your face, oh baby I don't really care what people say What they feel, what they think about it I'll never go away. Oh, no, no, no. I love you. I love you. Never gonna leave never you. Never gonna leave you. You're my all in all. You're my all in all. I'll never go away. He swept me off my feet completely and fully. And ever since that day, 
My life changed for the better. Justin might not be the best son-in-law to you, but he is the best man for me. Too bad you're blind to see the real him. Esther, my dear, please. Mother, I am not welcomed in this house as long as the man I love isn't. No, no. You are. I can't hide it anymore I really need to let you know How I feel I've swallowed my pride Whatever it takes To cross the bridge How we do it Oh my love Cause when you're not When you're not here by my side, I feel so lonely. Oh, I love you. Never gonna leave you. You're my all in all, baby. I'll never go away. Never go away. Oh, I love you. Never gonna leave you. You're my all. Still not in the right frame of mind to receive visitors. And mom has been wanting to hear from you. I'll call them later. plans to leave. To where? Justin, you and I know that you don't want to leave. If you had wanted to be as far away from her as possible, you, you wouldn't have been here by now. You're crazy about this girl. I know. So what are you waiting for? Go tell her. She's right here next door. Tell her how you feel. Yes. Possible you take her and run away because from what I'm seeing, that's the best option for you too. <laughs> Tempting. Guy, forget what you're doing on the screen. You are hurting. And she is hurting. So one of you has to make things right. Then the parents were standing on their daughter's way. She really loves you. She's crazy about you. So why, why, why will you do allow people's sentiment and talks keep you apart? Guy, 
This is not you. You need to act. Do something. Do what you know how to do best. This is not my brother. Just not be you again. I can hide it anymore. Yeah. I really need to let you know how I feel. I've swallowed my pride. Whatever it takes Whatever to cross the bridge, how we do it. Oh, my love. Cause when you're not here, when you're not here, I feel surrender. Is your boss in? Have to. Yes. Do you have any appointment with him? Is your Oga inside? I said, do you have any appointment with him? Can I just see your boss, please? Do you have any appointment with him? Jumaka! Sir! Who is that? Hey, hey, hold it there! Sir. What are you doing here? I would like to talk to you. Talk to me about what? I thought you were done talking. Now leave my house now! No, sir, you are done talking. But I'm not. Sir, I love your daughter. I love her so much that I cannot imagine a life without her. Look, I know that I left, but I am back for her. You are not making any sense. What he's trying to say, sir, or what he's saying actually is that he loves your daughter and he's not taking no for an answer. Except it's coming from her, which I know she won't say no. Jeremy, I got this. Sir, I'm sorry that I'm not the kind of guy you wanted for your daughter. But she completes me. And I'm pretty sure that she feels the same way around me. So, here's what I'm going to propose. And it's quite simple. Please, allow us to be together. And I promise, I swear, that I will take care of her. I'll make sure she's very comfortable. And I'll treat her like a queen that she is. Well, that was a beautiful proposal. Tempting evil. What if I refuse? Then I'll stop caring much about what you think and do what is right both for humanity and for God. Thank you for your time, sir. Jeremy? Justine? Won't you at least stay back for dinner? Um, no, ma'am. We, we, we can't stay. We need to be in our hotel right now. Our flight takes off very early tomorrow. Jeremy? Stay for dinner. Oh, we're going to leave tomorrow. Thank you. Oh, yeah. I can't hide it anymore. I really need to let you know. Swallowed my pride. Whatever it takes Whatever to cross the takes. bridge, how we do it. Oh, my love. Cause when you're not here, when you're not here, I feel so empty. Cause when you're not here by my side, I feel so lonely. Oh, I love you. Never gonna leave you, gonna leave you my all in all, baby. I'm there. What kind of a guy runs away at the first sight of trouble? No, tell me. Because I do not understand any of this. I do not even understand him. To think I really, really like this guy and rooted for you two to be together. No, he runs off like a coward without saying a word or even a call. Really? Gosh. <sighs> Esther, he runs off like a coward. Not even a call from.
from him, knowing that you have been through the worst kind of heartbreak that anyone on earth can ever be. God, he's really heartless. So this is it. The wedding of the century that I have been preparing for, for, for years now. This is it. Just like that. Okay, hey, listen up. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry I, I raised my voice, but I am just so angry and confused. I know that you're hurting right now. But what can we do? What do you want to do? Hunt him down. Are you expecting anyone? Hi. Um, is Esther in? Okay, I think we should give them a minute. Yeah. Say one demeaning word to her, and I will mess you up. No. Actually, you guys should stay. I want to say this in front of everyone. I'm sorry, babe. I am really Really sorry. About what? I'm sorry that I didn't stand by you. I'm sorry for letting what your dad said get to me. I'm sorry for bailing on you. I am sorry for not calling you. I'm even more sorry that I had the thought of us thinking this over. Because there's actually nothing to think over. It took me a great deal to hold this hand. And, and I am promising you in front of everyone standing here right now that I'd rather be dead before I ever let you go again. Because I love you, okay? I love you from the bottom of my heart. I am in love with you. I know that I may not be the man that your dad would have wanted for you, but I am not going to apologize for being me because this is the version of myself that loves you wholeheartedly. I swear this to you that not your dad, not your mom, not my parents, not even religion can come in between us. What we share is stronger than anything in the world. So please, Esther, Esther Samuel, will you do me the honor of being the man whose face you see before going to bed and the very first face you see when you wake up? I can hide it anymore 
to talk to me about whom I should marry, then I suggest you drop it. I love Justin, Christian or no Christian. He's the man I love and I love him for who he is. So please just let us be. Please. Justin came to the house yesterday with the brother. Um, we had a long conversation and uh, I think he's the best man for you. So I hereby give you my blessings, both of you. Auntie. <laughs> Thank you so much. So, young man, when are you coming over with your parents to do this needful? Any moment now. Yes. Congratulations. I can hide it anymore. I really need to let you know. Swallowed my pride Whatever it takes Whatever To cross the takes. bridge How we do it Oh my love Cause when you're not here When you're not here I feel so empty Cause when you're not here By my side I feel so lonely oh, I love you Never gonna leave you gonna leave you my all in all baby I'll never go away never go away oh, I love you love you never gonna leave you never gonna leave you you my all in all oh, baby. I'll never go away never go away oh, yeah. I've really tried to stay just me alone Never go away. Oh, no, no. I love you. Never gonna leave you. You're my own. 